Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. I am Soma from the Creative Academy. Here in this video, I am gonna share with you how to create this type of portfolio sections with hover effect when just hovering on this image you can see here this is just scrolling effect smooth scroll with this mouse effect means it's not hovering so it will come to the just normal effect you can see here this is just hovering so you can see this smooth, smooth scroll effect is here in this video i'll show you how to create it without installing one plugin or installing one free plugin i will show you both so in this video i'll show you just using only one free plugin i'm again saying i don't use any paid plugin or something i just only use by one free plugin only in one method or another method is that i am using some simple css so i'll just put the css link in the description you can just download it and paste it here in this video just go to the just page creating page and creating the sections so let's start all right just creating just two segment just sections at first we have to just install one plugin that is just element of just premium add-ons for elementor just click on this add new here you can see just element if i'm just searching for elementor just searching elementor after searching elementor you can see here elementor install add-ons and this is the premium add-ons for elementor by this type of just lip3 sorry this was just lip3 company so everything so you can see here this is the premium address for you have to install it and activate it after installing activity you can see this type of install now button so install in and activate it so after installing go to the page and selecting structure just click on plus icon click on the columns and sorry i'm just click on the plus icon and choose three column structure and then just click on this and then click on the height and then go to the minimum height and vh click on vh say just made it to 100 then click on the plus icon then place the inner section drag and drop the inner section here then you can see these the two columns so now i am just creating the this this portfolio so you can see here this is the portfolio so now i am creating this portfolio without using css uh, or something you can see this is the premium addons i am just already writing it you can see this just link up with the images and scrolling up this is made by on premium addons and you have to just only i'm just using this is in in this here in this main just section i'm using only css so now at first i am using only css i'm just showing you then i'll show you how to create it without just with installing one plugin so at first just i'm just creating this with css so after just drag and drop the inner section just delete one column deleted it then you can see this is just one just inner section then this column so just click on this column and go to the style tab and this is the background type just click on background image then just i'm selecting this background image you can also you have to select also your background image that is like uh, you have to select this your full website image you are not don't just select like um, 4 by 4 image or 16 x 9 image you have to select full image that that's ratio will be right 9 x to 16 if you have to just write it so remember it that just click on this section and go to the layout and height will be like um, minimum height and then the size will be just 400 right some just fine just click on the style tab then position will be top center and then attachment will be like nothing repeat will be no repeat and size will be cover like that you can see here this is just fine now just close this and go to the border border type right ds will be border i'm giving it to 10 then box shadow so giving the box shadow box shadow will be like uh, i'm just giving to vertical to i'm giving in vertical to 20 then blur will be like 30 and spread will be 10 then go to the color section click on this color and then just reduce this color opacity like from point point one black you can see here this is a black point one like this you can see here so it looks fine then just go to the border section again then it just i'm updating this after updating so just what is the image so i'm just click on preview changes so i don't want to reload reload the page and again and again you can see here this is just border yes this two just images and if i'm hovering now it is nothing nothing here so now you want to just put the image css just you have to just i'm just copying the css from here i will just you have to don't do nothing just go to the description and download the css snippet and just paste it here so 
let me show you shall it, let me show you how to where we, we can paste it just click on the section again go to the advanced tab then just scroll down you can see here custom css only in the elementary pro just remember it only in the elementary pro you can find the custom css element not the in not the free version so if you not download the elementary pro you have to download from the description then use it so just expand the custom css and just paste it here if i'm just showing you in the notepad you can see here this is the custom css you have to write so at the exact same the custom css you have to write here nothing to change this i'll i'm showing you how to change it or something so you have to just change just paste it from in the custom css then you will install you can also pause in the video and write it from here also i'm giving in the description you can also download it from here so if i'm just now hovering you can see here this is a smooth just scrolling up effect with uh, images so if i'm just hovering you i can see just i'm just hovering so it will smooth perfect so if i'm just now change the time if i'm just writing 10 seconds and now if i'm writing 10 seconds and just writing 10 seconds now if i'm just scrolling up you can see here is smooth scroll up with slowly it's slowly scroll up effect here because we are writing 10 seconds that's why so now if i'm just writing two seconds you can see just one second not writing two seconds just simply one second that's if i'm just worrying so you can see smooth just fast effect this is the fast effect you just are in so that's the default of four seconds i'm just giving to default four seconds and then just update it then update it and you can see this is just just blank effect so i'm just adding one heading and this type of just heading here just click on this ruby cube icon and just place the heading here so i'm placing the heading here and writing for like uh, this is the construction website so i'm writing construction construction and then give it to center alignment center go to the advanced tab unbind this margin and margin top will be like 30 pixel go to the style tab and text color will be like pure black and then go to the font so font size font pop-ins font will be like this and then weight will be like 800 sorry i'm giving it to 700 600 no the 700 is fine just i'm giving the size to 25 pixel like this and transform will be uppercase and then just giving it to size to 25 not 30 pixel 25 25 is fine everything is fine now so now i'm just duplicating it you can see here just duplicate it duplicate this whole to outer section not the inner section you have to duplicate the out section you can see the outer section so just you can see this is the inner section and this is the outer section if you follow my cursor you can see here just outer section you have to duplicate it just duplicate it and then again duplicate it then now, now we have to just delete this two column just deleting it and then again just delete it and just click on this go to the section and go to the style tab and choose the image so i'm changing the background image from here and then again just click on this section and then go to the style tab and choose the image so i'm choosing the image from here like this this one just writing so you can see here this is the just this is the website is just came just click on this heading and change the text if i'm just writing the text like uh, anything i'm just writing and then just click on this and if i'm just writing car like this if i'm just writing so it will just makes your pro portfolio section is cool that's why i'm just clicking selecting you can just see just this cursor is here and you can also you can also remove the cursor from here if i'm just writing this click on this and go to the advanced tab go to the custom css and you can see this is the cursor pointer if you want don't want to just do the cursor you want to show the cursor just delete it after deleting i'm just updating this and you will see so after updating you can see here this is just cursor is not here this is just cursor the hand mouse cursor point is not here you can see the hand icon is here but in the in this image this is not showing the hand icon so in the free method in the just CSS method in the, the that is also free we can use it now i'm showing you how to create it with just installing plugin i am suggesting you to installing plugin and just paste just use it because it, it has only just two options that is just now i'm just not it's connecting with the link i'm not connecting i cannot connect with the any just cursor overlay everything i cannot connect so after installing just over the themes you can see this is the sorry after installing the plugins you can see the problem premium add-ons for elementor you have to install it and activate it so after installing you can see just click on the plus icon 
and I'm just selecting the heading one heading here because it is less looking so not cool just click on this and padding I'm just giving it to top and bottom will be like 50 pixel padding and click on the plus icon and place the heading here so I'm just copying the heading from here and paste it I don't want to create the heading so just click on this and advanced step sorry I'm just giving this click on the heading and top will be like margin I'm giving it to zero then I'm just writing premium add-ons so this is the plugins name I'm just writing me to just show the better understand just click on the style tab and I'm giving it the size to like uh, 45 pixel that's it and then this color will be like uh, this type of colors that's it so now you want to just installing the plugin after installing the plugin you want to just search for gallery if you search for sorry just search for image if you search for image you can see this is a premium adult it's called like PA icon is here you can see here in the cursor you can see this is a PA means premium add is here so now you want to just select one cursor or you can also select just one inner section like that just click on this and then just click on the risky icon and then just press the inner section from here click on this section and go to the advanced tab unbind this padding and top will be like uh, 40 or 50 pixel so i'm giving it to 50 pixel click on the plus icon and if you search for image again so if you can see this premium image call is here just place it here after placing i'm just covering two image or duplicating on an image so now you can see here this is just images so just click on this and choose the image like there just installing just plugin and then just search for just images if you search for images so if you search for just images images sorry i'm just giving the spelling so you can see this is the images and this is the premium add-ons images is here just place just place it here nothing to do just place it here so i'm deleting it again and then just select three column structure and just selecting this and just if i'm searching for images so you can see this just images and then place it here then click on this and choose the image if i'm just searching for choose the image like this and then if i just not just choose the image you can see I'm not doing anything I don't do anything just choose the image and if I'm just hovering now you can see automatically smooth calm effect so in these features just you have to add you can add link you can add overlay everything just click on advanced settings then you can see the overlay just click on this you can see this overlay is came from just hovering so you can see only in the normal normal so you can see this is a black type of overlay section black type of black color overlay is here but if I'm hovering so it will just come go out and then smooth or scroll up to come so now you can just click on image settings and you can just click on the link you can also click whenever a customer whenever someone click on this image then it will, it will direct to the another link or another website you can just paste it here link there so if i'm just searching for just if i'm copying the link uh, elementor link so elementor website link i'm just pasting it link the url and just click on this settings icon you can see here this is the link options click on the settings icon and click on open a new window so it will looks better just click on update and then just click on this style tab then click on the container you can see this is a border radius so i'm giving it to 10 pixel as it is you can see here this is a border radius and the box shadow that's why i'm just giving then click on the box shadow and click on the color and then place the color from here if i'm just writing for one then just particularly will be like 20 pixel this is 30 pixel and spread will be like 10 pixel that's it so you can see this is the just border will came and then now i want to just add uh, something like you can just um, um, height so just click on this and content and then you can see image height so this is the 300 i'm giving it to 400 like this like this image now i want to add the heading so i'm just already copying them just create the heading so i'm just copying this so i'm just pasting it here you can see this is came then just again i'm i'll copying it here but i'm just duplicating it again then i'm duplicating them just delete this column then delete this column then again duplicating it after duplicating just click on this and change the image after change just click on this image and then i'm changing the image from here so now remember it just you have to now you have to just screenshot the full website don't select on any section or particulars in so it will not scrollable you have to just capture the full screenshot of your website then it will come just working that's why so just click i'm just copying this heading and then again paste it here and then deleting it so it will look cool so i'm just click on this 
I'm just giving the changing the title or something even the giving so them uh, to look the same as it is then just update it after updating you will see then it is just blank it will not like good so just click on this one column structure and then click on this and go to the advanced tab and when this padding and top will be like uh, uh, 100 pixel and then bottom will be like 100 pixel and now just click on the style tab and giving the background color like uh, this background color and then giving the top one heading so i'm already created a heading just copying this heading and then just paste it and then go to the style tab and giving the color from here like this and then just change the color like uh, my port if i'm just writing my portfolio and then just go to the style tab in the front you can see this is just uh, just curve effect it is a like wave effect or curve effect i'm showing you in the front you can see this uh, this type of effect so how to do that i'll show you how to do that so just click on this portfolio and then typography will be like um, 65 and like this and then click on the section again go to the just this point this and then go to the shape divider go to the bottom and then just select select like uh, tilt you can see this is like tilt and then height will be adjustable just i'm giving the height to like this 90 pixel and then update it now if i'm updating you can see here this is just a portfolio section is just came so now i'm just giving this click on the settings and you can see this minimum height so i'm just giving it to default and then go to the advanced tab now and unbind this padding and top will be like uh, 30 pixel and bottom will be 50 pixel that's it and then update it then you can see this came so now you can see this is the portfolio with just cover effect portfolio section and then if i'm just now scrolling you can see this is just made by only using css not installing any other plugins and just in this is only made by css then if i'm just scrolling down you can see the all the images will be scrollable with box add one of our effect if i'm just scrolling down you can see this is this type of just premium add-ons for elementor this plug this section is just scrollable which is made by on premium installing one plugin that is free and premium addons for element that is also free so you can use it for later you can just if you just click on this image you can see here the elementor is page is elementor website which came i'm just linking up the website you can see just click on this then the elementor website is came in the another type elementor website will open so i'll suggest you to use the premium addons for elementor because it's you will get a just extra two features that is like overlay click on link it link a the website or link a new tab or link a page you can also add link anything so it will get more extra two features but in the in this you are using custom CSS you will get say, just two features so that's it i'm just showing you how to create it in the both way from using without installing plugins or with installing plugins using CSS or without using CSS. so if you like this video please give it a big thumbs up and share with your friends that who will need this video and subscribe to the channel and comment down how is it how is the video and if you want more topics elementor tricks and tricks and if you're facing some problems to create it so please just comment down just comment down feel free comment down and then if you download the elementor pro so if you want to that so please i mean just put on the link in the description you can download download the elementor pro from the description and if you want more topic as your topic so please comment down as your topic i'll cover the topic later I'll see you in the next video. Till then, bye-bye. Thanks for watching.